Welcome to Mastering and Guideline in Ultrasound and Echo. Hi everyone. In this group of presentation, I am going to cover up all topics in the field of the POCUS or point of care ultrasonography. Uh, this uh, field of the sonography has been developed during last one and a half decade and add on to uh, many educational program, including general practitioner, emergency uh, medicine practitioner and sonographer in many center and many countries. And I strongly recommend every uh, of those people in these fields get uh, used to and learn this type of the study. And with new technology that is cost only a few thousand bucks, we just we need a cell phone software and a probe, we can perform this uh, reliable and fast diagnostic test on a bedside manner. And uh, it's uh, critically very important in those uh, emergency patient and critical situation, ICU, and even in the sometime in office. Uh, this uh, group we can uh, divide it to the each organs like the heart, lung, GI, OBGYN, musculoskeletal, vascular, and nowadays even uh, neurologic condition, uh, some limited neurologic condition, and for uh, procedure uh, that it can guide and help us to perform those type of the procedures. In, uh, now let's go to give an example how much this uh, type of study can help for diagnosis in critical situations. Here is an example of the, how much the POCUS can help us to approach those especially critical patients. Uh, for example, imagine you are dealing with the patient in shock and on those basic uh, study like the EKG or ECG blood test and physical exam didn't uh, give us very clear uh, finding and conclusive just with the uh, sonography in those uh, three fields including chest means lung and heart to rule out any pneumotrox, no, uh, hemotrox, cardiac tamponade, uh, any CAD acute MI and situation of the IVC for the volume central venous system volume and finally rule out any emergency critical emergency in abdomen just with five to ten minutes we can get to the result and make decision for management and if the less than 10 to 15% uh, of cases maybe is not conclusive, then we can make decision for go more advanced and do CT scan and MRI. At least with this finding, we can stabilize the patient and save time and money for uh, uh, and to get to the point to take care of the patient. 